Hey guys, Bad Infos here and these are my 10 least favorite missions in Bully. The game has some incredibly creative and unique missions and activities, unfortunately some are bland, boring and uninteresting. I'll showcase them here and I hope you agree that they simply suck. The list will not contain cutscene missions where you just watch something like in Small Offenses, but actual missions where you do something with Jimmy. Without further ado, here are the worst missions in Bully. We begin with Jealous Johnny, one of the buggiest missions in the game with one of the best characters, Johnny, and of course one of the worst characters, Lola. The idea is to take a camera and take pictures of Lola cheating on Johnny. Seems simple enough, if bugs did not exist, sometimes your shot will not count despite it being right on target forcing you to get closer, only to be seen and fail the mission. Other times the people you need to take a picture of do the same thing multiple times and you have to wait a lot so they can start the next activity. It just takes too long, it's too wonky and it's very boring. Lola's a bit of a slut it seems. I knew it, I just knew it! Number 9 is here still Mrs. Phillips of Fetch Quest. Woohoo! One of the many on the list, you hate Fetch Quest. I hate fetch quests. Everybody hates fetch quests. This one is a bit exciting, I guess, since their enemy is going after you, providing some danger, but if you get a fast bike, you may never even see them. Just go around town, get some items and come back. With you. Uh -huh. And he is so cute! Cute. <laughs> nice. Number 8 goes to busting in part 1, no not part 2, in part 2 you infiltrate a factory, fight lots of people, solve puzzles and more. Here all you do is drive a huge distance to the rich neighborhood, talk to Russell and then travel all the way to the opposite part of the map and watch a cutscene. How is this exciting? No danger, nothing nice to look at, only Russell's butt in front of you and you know that that's not a great view. <laughs> Number 7 is Discreet Deliveries, told you guys, second fetch quest. Well, more like a delivery quest for Mr. Watts. Travel across the map, pick up an item, deliver packages to 5 different people, who of course are spread out across the whole map, and return to the school. Unlike the previous similar mission I showed, there's no excitement. Sure, you're doing it at night, which makes it a bit scarier, but that does not change much. Ah, James! Splendid! Number 6 is the eggs. As the name suggests, the mission involves eggs, but it's not the mission in which you egg a house, so no no. That one has danger, has interesting characters and is also a bit difficult. In this one all you do is get some eggs, take them to a guy, watch a cutscene, take a key and get out, that's it. Yeah, sure you do fight some people but they're wimps and you don't need to fight them all. The mission is done quickly and the only redeeming factor is the funny cutscene. You've been rude about mommy, let's get this popper. Number 5 is Hattrick vs Galloway. I mean sure the cutscene is one of the funniest cutscenes in the whole game as I showed in my other top 10 videos, but what you do in this mission itself is dumb and boring. It's a fetch quest, get 3 bottles so you can clear Galloway's name. The drunk fool who always gets into trouble, not much to explain, fetch the bottles, take them to Mrs. Phillips and that's it. Thanks Jimmy. You're welcome Miss. Number 4 goes to Beach Rumble. The mission starts with an amazing cutscene where Jimmy is talking trash to some losers. The losers steal a trophy and Jimmy gives chase. At this point you think that there's gonna be an epic bike chase across the map. You would have to throw items, fight an army of people, maybe sneak in a building and get the trophy, but no! You go to the safe house, beat up one guy and get it. Mission done! All these guys are not even necessary, you can just run around until the important person spawns, beat him up and get it, boring as they get. Hey Jimmy, you want some help handling those losers? On number 3 I would actually like to place two missions which are very similar in nature, their greaser challenge and towny challenge. All you do is enter a safe house, 
and beat up a bunch of people. Just stay there, mash the button for a minute and you are done. Not even much danger since you can just heal as you're beating them up. For me it is both for the same mission since there's no differences between them. Once you complete one you also complete the other in a way. I want you gone! Get lost! Number 2 is not cracking. You know how much I hate music class, right? Music class sucks in my opinion and not cracking is music class cranked up to 11. It's basically level 5 of music tripled. You play a huge song for several minutes. The prompts are easy enough to get right, but just standing there and doing nothing for so long is not my idea of fun. You can't even look at the funny dancing Eunice in the background is doing, cause you gotta concentrate on the left of the screen. I would have liked some variety or something, but unfortunately we didn't get it. You know, for a hippie you're a real bully, ma'am. And on number one I would like to play is Christmas is here, the worst mission in the land. Some may not consider this even a mission, but I do since you do a task in it and the task is go from here to there and watch a cutscene. Yes, done, the mission is passed. Even the reward sucks, nobody likes this outfit, people make fun of you if they see it. The mission is even forced, meaning that you have to accept it after going to bed. You can't skip it and do it whenever you please. No, it has to be done right now and you get a dumb reward. Very disappointing. Oh, there you are, Jimmy. I'll make this quick. Your mom has sent you a Christmas present. And guys, this concludes my list. Do you agree? If not, let me know which ones you hate the most. Subscribe to my channel for more top lists, lists for best characters, best cutscenes and what not. Thank you so much for watching and a very special thank you goes to my top channel members and patrons. Munish Pradeep, Alex Chavez, Max Robinson, LMP Racing, House the Chowder, Max Rich, Smokey O and everybody else on the screen. Thank you so much.